loves and besties, welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, yan, tama yung nababasa niya sa title. So, we're talking about anxiety and overthinking during the quarantine. So, ayun. I know this is a quite sensitive topic and not everyone is comfortable talking about this. But, I'm gonna share with you guys my experience. No, what are the things that I'm doing every time I'm experiencing overthinking. Lalo na for those people who are away from their loved ones. Or from people they are comfortable, uh, com comfortable being with. So, ayun. I list down the stuff that I'm doing every time na nag-overthink ako or feeling ko, nag-overthink ako. And I hope na makatulong sila sa inyo. So, ayun, overthinking is a thing na hindi naman natin may iwasan. Especially for us girls. So, ayun. Ngayong quarantine kasi, I'm not at home. So, we're stuck here at the dorm since we can't go home. And mas convenient then for our work to stay at the dorm. So, ayun, syempre, sometimes when you're stressed or when you have a lot of things to do, you can't avoid na mag-overthink or, you know, anxiety attack sometimes. So, for the past almost three months, I think I had like four episodes or three and ito yung mga bagay na ginagawa ko to lessen yung episode ng pag-overthink ko which I can't avoid. I know some of you guys are crying at their room when they are alone or can't avoid thinking of negative stuff that can happen. But I hope itong mga isi-share ko sa inyo ay matulungan kayo somehow. So, let me know if they are helping you or they will help you for the next few days. So, comment down below after a week or few days if natulungan kayo ng mga tips na to. So, tip number one, listen to relaxing music. So, ayun, there's a lot of free music sa YouTube. Like, there are piano, acoustic, violin, those kind of musics can help you to avoid overthinking, lalo na before sleeping or when you're doing some stuff or anything or when you're not doing anything. Um, listening to those kind of musics can really help your mind to be relaxed. Or sometimes I also listen to my favorite songs where I can sing along para hindi nagkakaroon ng chance yung mind ko na mag-isip ng kung ano-anong, alam yun, mga negative thoughts or anything. So, ayun, tip number one. Tip number two, tea instead of coffee. So, I'm a kind of person who is very, very, very addicted to coffee. So, ayun, instead of drinking much coffee per day, um, you can just try drinking coffee. I mean, drinking tea. So, pwede pa rin naman kayong mag-coffee but not too much. So, what I'm doing uh, for the past few days now, I'm drinking green tea every morning. And then after like an hour or 30 minutes, I'll drink coffee. And then before I sleep, I'm also drinking relaxing tea. You can try chamomile tea or mint tea. Ugh. Or mint tea. And those will help you sleep really well. Promise. So, number three, finding things you can do at home. So, ayun, ako kasi sometimes when I overthink, I used to organize my stuff. Pwede nyo rin siyang gawin, like, if nakita nyo na yung drawer nyo, magulo na or what not, you can organize your stuff. And that can help you be relaxed, swear. Or, ayun, you can watch videos or movie. There's nothing wrong in using TikTok. You can also use TikTok to, alam mo yun, para lang may magawa kayo. You don't have to video yourself or whatnot. You can just watch random videos para hindi magkaroon ng chance yung utak nyo na mag-isip negatively and you'll be entertained also. 
So, number four, learn to ignore some things. So, ayun, you should always tell yourself na not everything that is happening around you should affect you. So, you should learn to train your mind not to be so reactive to those um to those um things na nangyayari sa iyo or sa paligid mo so sometimes you have to ignore them in order for you to stop overthinking kasi sometimes we are being affected by the things that we should not be so ayun we should um learn to train our mind to be alam mo to be focused on important um things instead na magpa-affect ka sa mga bagay na alam mo yun, yung wala ka namang control or wala namang connection sa'yo. So, last, but, hindi pa dapat siya totally last, pero ginawa kong five lang because, alam mo yun, mahirap din na marami tayo masyadong tinatry or ginagawa. So, I only wrote five. So, last is connect with people or connect to people. So, ayun, since we are quarantined, we are not allowed to go out. Sabi nga ni Kim Ju, bawal tayong lumabas. Kahit ayusin mo ba yung lawn ng bahay nyo, hindi ka pa rin pwede lumabas best. So, ayun. Um, you can connect to people through social media or any platforms. Um, you can connect to people through Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. Or, alam mo yun, you can chat your friends through Messenger, WhatsApp, Viber. Anything that can make you connect to people. Or, alam mo yun, um, find people who will listen to you. So, ayun, if you think na wala, I'm here, you can chat me through Messenger, WhatsApp, Viber, Instagram, or Twitter. So, I'll put my Twitter and my Instagram on the description box. And if feeling mo wala kang, alam mo yun, if you are, um, if you're not comfortable opening up to people close to you, you can try opening up to people who doesn't know you. Because those people will not gonna judge you. So, ayun. Kung gusto mo lang naman, you can talk to me. Pero, ayun nga. Or, if you're not really com um, comfortable opening up to anyone, like, you can write down your thoughts or you can type it on the notepad of your laptop or of your phone. Anything na, alam mo yun, you can release what you're thinking. Ayun, sometimes, um, sometimes yung ginagawa ko, every time I'm listening to, ayun nga, mga relaxing music, ganon, and I still can't control my mind to overthink. What I'm doing is that I'm writing all my thoughts in a notepad or in a jotter pad para lang ma-free up yung mind ko. So, that, um, that stuff can help naman. So, ayun guys, those are the stuff that I'm doing whenever I'm overthinking. So, ayun, I just want you to know that you're not alone. I made this video because I know I'm, I'm not the only one experiencing overthinking. So, ayun, I just want you to know that there are people who are here for you, who wanted to motivate you. So, yeah, stay home and be safe and keep going. That's all for this vlog. Bye-bye, boo.